Okay, all right, so guys, this is a clean battle about a first responder services. I'm just making a couple videos back to back today because I want to get the message out to you. As you know, uh, Reverend Jesse Jackson has been infected with COVID-19, um, tested positive for COVID-19, as well as Governor, um, uh, the governor of Texas, Greg Abbott, has also tested positive for uh, COVID-19. So it's really impacting me because I am involved in the community of people that have been a part of COVID-19, not necessarily in the clinical side, but also on the community impact side, as well as um, the governor of New York, um, Andrew Cuomo, has just resigned from his position with his COVID-19 task force due to sexual allegations made against him. So, but he, he has been one of the foremost leaders in the initiatives behind telling not only the state of New York about COVID-19 research, but again, telling the whole world about what is going on uh, with COVID-19. So again, this is the Queen Bottle. Uh, right now, I want to talk about the title of my video today. It's called Praying. Praying. So um, pretty much um, what God's... I, I really want to address a quick, quick issue. I'm trying to make this video about five to seven minutes, make it quick and short. I have my little head scuff on, which is good. I just went to two drinks today. I thought it may help me a little bit dealing with the stress and the grieving that I'm going with right now, losing my uncle to cancer or whatever the situation happened, and also losing that family line lineage that is happening to me at the same time of the canards, that canard lineage. So I'm really going through a lot, dealing with a lot of emotions right now. So um, the title of my video is called Pray Versus Meditating, okay? Um, I really want to make this very, very, very clear. There is a difference between, I'm not Oprah, okay? <laughs> I'm not Ian LaVenzant. Okay, this is not a job, this is who I am, this is my life. This is not a job, I'm not a prophetess, I'm not, I'm not a board certified doctor, I'm still a queen battle, okay? So pretty much I have personal experiences, I talk to you guys about what I'm going through and hopefully you'll be able to understand the same, okay? So what I, the title of my video today is called Praying Versus Meditating, okay? There is a difference, okay? Praying, okay, is having a personal relationship with you and your God, okay? It doesn't necessarily have to be between, um, it could be between Jehovah, it could be between Jesus, uh, Jesus Christ, it could be, be between um, whoever is your immediate belief system in your life, okay? It's your it, in, immediate belief system in your life, how whatever has guided you that spiritual path that has guided you in your life, okay? So for me, my personal belief system is in God, Jesus Christ, as well as the Holy One. Now, even though I attend a Catholic church, even though I go to Catholic Mass, I still believe in the Lord Jesus Christ as my personal Savior, okay? I still believe in the Lord Jesus Christ as my personal Savior. There are a lot of Catholics that also accept Jesus Christ as a personal savior. At the same time, though, there is a little bit conflict between the two. Okay, but, but, I still also attend churches where I attend Baptist churches, I attend clergy churches, I attend non-denominational denominational churches, I attend Catholic churches, and I have a tattoo above my right eye that has a cross on it. It's not necessarily demonic or gang related, it's just who I am, it's my personality. So I accept God as the Lord of my life, Jesus Christ. That's great. So who do I pray to? I pray to God, I pray to Jesus Christ. But there's a difference between praying to your spiritual God in your life versus meditating on a God or meditating on a situation in your life that you want to change. When you meditate in your life, you, you relax, you remain calm, you remain focused. And sometimes, somehow that meditation for five minutes or 10 minutes guides you and it guides you into has some kind of focus on where you need to be. Okay, now, when you're praying, you pray, okay, it's not necessarily you're meditating or having a physical, physical focus. Praying is a spiritual focus. There's nothing physical about it, okay? It doesn't necessarily have to do anything with your body. 
praying, okay, you're giving your spirit man over to God as well as your your inner man, okay, your spirit, mind, body, your body, your mind, body, and emotions is praying to who you believe in, and you're you're giving over your inner man and saying, somebody please help me. Okay? You are at that moment of time on your hands and knees, or you are alone. Or you are set in a mo in a motion where you want to make a change in your life, and usually what happens is the Bible says that in God's word I have the Gideon's Bible here. Okay, I really I, I should be carrying the Bible around a lot more, but I don't. The Bible says that prayer changes things. Okay, that's what the Bible says. I'm gonna try to make this video real quick because I, ha I have a whole list to go through, as well as I have some issues to talk about with the church, as well as some issues to talk about COVID, as well as some issues to do with political, as well as some other issues. Okay, it says God's word says prayer changes things. Okay, prayer changes things, and that's how we want to be in motion. Okay, prayer changes things to help your life. And so when you meditate, you just you have that that one fix five ten minute emotion in your life and then you're done okay and then you have to meditate again and again and again in order to get that focus in order to get that belief to get that that action emotion of what you want to be usually sometimes most of the time prayer all you need is just one at, at one belief moment of time for that one prayer in your life to change completely and sometimes, usually it says in, in God's word, when two or more are gathered and believing in one thing, it will change some amongst them, okay? Sometimes prayer works for yourself or other, at other times it can work when you believe in it, you, you are holding hands and believing with other people, how that situation will change for your life, which is good, which is a good thing, okay? But usually when you're meditating, okay, this is my own personal belief system, I'm not a board certified doctor. It's, this is not a job for me. This is who I am. Okay. Usually, when you are meditating on an issue, okay, you have a fixed belief about this issue, and so it allows you to to remain calm and remain steady on what that issue is to be addressed. Okay. That's how meditating it, it causes you to focus. It's good for relaxing. It's good for your health. But at the same time, you have to continually, continually to do the same thing over and over and over again to get to that level where you need to be at. Prayer, sometimes, you don't have to get to a level in prayer. It will allow you to get deep. You can get deeper and deep, deeper to prayer. But it's between you and your belief system, okay? Who you are and what God you believe in. And usually, usually, most of the time, it's just, it changes your life. You may not notice it, a prayer at that one moment of time, at that day, or at that moment, or at that hour, but eventually, through faith, faith just decide, this, this, the, the size of a mustard seed, sometimes, most of the time, all it takes is just one seed of faith in order for your life to change, for your life to change. Okay, so meditating is good, but prayer is constant. Prayer is permanent. Prayer is constant. So it's great to meditate. I'm not saying anything's wrong with meditating. I'm not saying it's new age. Meditating is great, but prayer you have to you have to when you meditate you have to back back it up with something else. It's not just a new age. It's not just emotional feel. You have to back it up with something. But prayer, okay. Prayer, you are backing it up with the spiritual man of God that's inside of you. That's inside of you. You have to back it up. You have to back it up. Okay? So prayer is good. Okay? Meditating is good. But prayer is better. Okay? Prayer is better. Okay? Alright, so this is Queen at Battle First Aid Responder Services. Uh, love you guys. Uh, just talk about one of my... Um, my, I have a couple other videos to get there right quickly. It's called Pray versus Meditate. Okay? Alright, so I love you guys. On to my next.